I'm presently a co-principal investigator on an ongoing randomized impact evaluation of a community-driven development program in Afghanistan. This is actually the largest development program in Afghanistan. It's a $1.3 billion program. And the intent of the evaluation is to try to see what effect development has on the economic well-being and governance of rural Afghans. Many people claim that we find ourselves in, at a, in a bind in Afghanistan. It's kind of the Gordian knot. What's the role of a political scientist in that context? Um, I argue that there is a role to the degree that we can help uh, policymakers make informed decisions on how best to allocate the resources that they have. Resources are limited and therefore we have to be very careful in what ways we use them and we have to be careful to make sure that they're not actually feeding the insurgency but they're there to promote peace and, and improve the lives of Afghans, be they in rural areas, in the cities or in areas actually confronted with uh, security issues. MIT's Department of Political Science has a great concentration of really remarkable faculty members that work in a lot of uh, overlapping areas. So there's definitely a big emphasis on experimental work, be it lab experiments or field experiments. It offers the leading cross-cutting training that people would need to be competitive candidates in, in the field, while also giving an opportunity uh, to feel special <laughs> in the sense of professors actually knowing you, uh, feeling closer to fellow students, being involved in collaborative work.